everyone and welcome back to my channel. I have not made a video in a while. Uh, I'm gonna try to keep up more of my videos because I want to be a lot more consistent and I want to start just, I don't know, making my videos better. I have a better camera and I want to start editing them better. I might get a new laptop soon so hopefully my videos will be a lot more consistent and better in the future but I just decided to do a haul. I think the last video I posted here was a haul but I don't know I get really excited to do hauls for some reason like sometimes I'll just do hauls for my cousins on snapchat so anyway I'm gonna do a haul it's a thrifting haul mostly I have a couple things um, here and there that aren't but I thought I would just add them in because I just got them as well but yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and get right into it so I recently got into thrifting which I know I'm late on the bandwagon for this because I feel like everyone has been thrifting ever since I don't know like 2013 like people have been doing this and I'm sure you're like this is just a way of life for people um but i don't know what it was recently i was like you know what i want to start going to thrifting and see if i can find anything that is like unique and i went to um goodwill one day and i couldn't believe like how many like brand new and cute things that like were like a dollar or like four dollars um, so I got like so many brand new things and then I started going to Salvation Army because they have half off on Wednesdays and I just like my mind is blown like I know this is a thing I know that people do it but I just thought that I couldn't I just thought like oh nothing will fit me like what are the odds I actually find something cute um, but I love thrifting I feel like really inspired to DIY like I like finding cute like vintage t-shirts and cropping them and I just I love it and I feel like trends come and go so fast that you can get something for a dollar at like Salvation Army and wear it like twice and it was a dollar. So I, I don't know, I feel like a lot of times I feel like, oh, I need a t-shirt, let me go to H&M and buy like a $10 t-shirt. What if I go to Salvation Army and get one for like a dollar or 50 cents? So I don't know, I think this is great. I feel like I used to spend so much money on clothes and going shopping and now I just go to Salvation Army and buy like five things for like $10 and it's great it's amazing 10 out of 10 would recommend now i'm actually going to get into the haul so um i have a couple things that i got today a couple things that i've been getting throughout the month um first off i want to start with this jacket and i kind of went in looking for a big oversized denim jacket and i didn't expect this to look good on me but this is a women's large i don't really know what the company is champs denim um but this is so cute it's a really light wash denim and there's some like maybe acid wash in there. I don't know why it's not here. That's better. Um, it kind of looks like a cloud or like the sky. I think it's so cute. It's really oversized on me. So I feel like it'll be, it'll be perfect for the fall and winter time. And I love it. I feel like it's something Ariana Grande would wear. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited about this. This was $2, I think too. And then this was $1. I got this little t-shirt, which again, like, I don't know how much I'll wear this, but it was a dollar. I thought it was really cute and I just cropped it. And it says Big Cat Rescue in Tampa. And I think it's so cute. I love it. Like I saw this and I was like, this looks like it's like 90s. And I know that I can crop it and make it look really cute. So I feel like this is just, I don't know. It's really cool and it looks kind of vintage and I love it. Next from Goodwill. Goodwill I feel like has a little bit nicer stuff and like stuff that's newer. But I actually found this which is, I think like, it looks pretty vintage because the tag's cut out and I just feel like, I don't know this is something someone will wear like in the 80s or 90s but it has like little blue floral flowers all over it and it's so cute it's a button down and I just tied it in a little knot at the bottom um, to make it a little bit cuter and yeah I love this I think I don't remember how much this was but I think it was like three or four dollars and the last thing I got at Goodwill is this um, Abercrombie Fitch dress it's so cute I saw this and I kind of bought it to almost resell because they still had the tags on it and I think I got this for $16 or so so yeah this isn't like super cheap but it's a lot cheaper than the price was I think it was originally like $60 at Abercrombie & Fitch but I've been loving stars lately and I love this color and I really like the bottom as well I just think it's so cute and I love Abercrombie & Fitch their dresses lately like on the actual site are so cute and so my style but yeah I got this it was a small it was a little bit big on me but I just tied the back and it fits me perfectly now and it's so cute. This is probably one of my favorite things that I found. Then I'm jumping back to Salvation Army and the other day I just randomly went in there. I feel like thrifting is very hit or miss obviously um, but I got this really cute dress from Hollister for two dollars. 
um, and it has little palm trees and polka dots all over it and it fits me perfectly and I was really shocked that I found this actually because it looks like it's like been worn maybe once um, and it's super cute I wore this on the 4th of July then I got this little scad t-shirt um, I was gonna cut it and crop it but I like it tied in a knot and I've been wearing this all the time I don't know what it is I think I just really like yellow as well um, and I am very artsy so I like that it's a scad t-shirt um, my brother actually looked into going to scad so that's kind of cool but I don't know I just thought it was cute and I like that it has this little painters palette on it um, but yeah I love this lastly from my thrifting journey this past month I just got this little um, white cami tank top kind of thing and then I cut it and cropped it this is like a dollar I'm pretty sure um, this I mainly got to wear under the shirt I got in Greece actually um, but yeah this is really cute it's just easy to throw on if I'm going outside to the beach or anything it was a dollar so there's that yeah I've just really been loving thrifting lately I feel really inspired when I go there to just like be more risky with my fashion even stuff like this like this isn't something I would normally buy it's a little bit more like sporty and I don't know a little bit different than stuff I would normally buy I feel like my style is very girly but since it was a dollar I was like let me try it out and like venture out of my comfort zone um I went to Bath and Body Works today for this specific thing I don't know what it was I think I just thought of it and I was like oh yeah Bath and Body Works sells this um but it's pretty much just a sparkly um body spray also if you hear noise in the background i have two kittens in my room right now that are like attacking each other but anyway um this is just like a body mist that's sparkly and so i thought it'd be nice to like spray on my body and it my body would sparkle in the sun so <laughs> i got this i got the warm vanilla sugar scent um because i just wanted to throw back i used to always use this in middle school and yeah so i got that then I had to show this because I seriously think it's the cutest thing in the entire world. I went to TJ Maxx recently and I did not intend on buying anything because like I said, I've literally only been shopping at the thrift store lately. Um, but I found this and I thought it was too cute to pass up. It was $25 so it was a really good price and I feel like this is something I would see at free people for like $100. Um, it looks kind of weird when I hold it up because the waist cinches in so it looks pretty big but um it's so cute it just has this really cute pattern all over it that looks like patches of different patterns um and the bottom is really flowy and it's just the cutest thing i've ever seen in my life and i can't wait to wear this and today i did not intend on going shoe shopping i was actually going to go to tj maxx but there's a shoe carnival right next door and they're having a sale and i was like i need new shoes because my shoes for work i wear like nikes for work and they are just destroyed um, so they had buy one get one half off at shoe carnival and I got these cute gray Nikes I had black ones before and I just thought that these were cute I was gonna get pink ones but I felt like this went better with everything and they're really comfortable and I'm just glad that I have new work shoes and for the half off I got these for ten dollars they were on sale for 20 and then I got them for half off um, are just these really cute little booties and I thought they'd be perfect for like summer transitioning into fall and since I live in Florida it doesn't really get that cold so I feel like I can just wear these year round and yeah they're super cute and I love them so yeah that's it for my thrifting slash other things haul I hope you guys enjoyed I hope it inspired you to go thrifting as well because I feel like whenever I watch someone do like a thrifting haul it just makes me want to go find cool stuff and unique things and I feel like I've already said all this but Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be making more videos, so if you have any requests, I think I might be doing like a skincare routine um, and just, I don't know, some other creative, maybe like DIY videos. And yeah, thank you for watching and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.